and it is our second semi-final fight in the Coliseum Featherweight Championship Tournament. Introducing first to the blue corner, Maxime Raylian. In colțul albastru, doamnelor și domnilor, Maxime Raylian. And introducing his opponent to the red corner, Levon Revazishvili. Iar în colțul roșu, Cipriotul Levon Revazishvili. Levan Revazishvili! Levan Revazishvili! Ladies and gentlemen, this fight is our second semi-final fight in the Coliseum Featherweight Championship Tournament. The winner of this contest will advance to the tournament final later this evening. Este a doua semifinală, câștigătorul acestei lupte va ajunge în finală. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. He's 30 years old and stands 168 centimeters tall and weighed in at 64.4 kilos. With a professional record of 40 wins, 14 losses, and three draws. 21 wins coming by way of knockout. He is from Moldova. He is known as the Fireboy. This is Maxi! And his opponent standing across the ring and fighting out of the red corner. He's 21 years old and stands 175 centimeters tall and weighed in at 64.7 kilos. His professional record stands at 10 victories and two defeats, two wins coming by way of knockout. From the Republic of Georgia, by way of Cyprus, Leo Levo! Da, da, ați înțeles bine din colțul roșu, Levan Revazishvili, leul. Your referee at the bell, Iunut Atodirese. Guys, listen my comment, don't fight after say stop, respect the rules. Go back in our corner, judge. Judge, first round, time, fight! Who will advance in the Coliseum Featherweight Championship Tournament? We will find out right now, ladies and gentlemen, our second semi-final matchup of the evening. The winner will face Adrian Maxim. We know that so far, and right now, a classic case of veteran versus newcomer here. Ray Leon has over 50 fights in his career, and Revazishvili just 12 professional fights. So look at this now. Ray Leon already closing the distance and looking to do some damage here to the Cypriot, who is originally from the Republic of Georgia. Done commentary for. 
both of these fighters at different points, and uh, they have looked very impressive, both of them. So very interested to see how these two are going to match up in the ring. Of course, Ray Leon, this is no new situation for him. He's competed in several tournaments before and has won tournaments in the past. Ray Leon did win the KOK World Grand Prix in 2014. Revazishvili has never competed in a tournament before, but he just ate the right hand twice from Ray Leon here in round number one. Revazishvili, I think he needs to utilize a little bit more movement here. He cannot afford to just stand in front of the fire boy and take damage like this. Misses with a right hand and now starts moving around, but he finds himself trapped against the ropes here once again. If he's going to do that, he's got to fire back, and there's a head kick. Ray Leon gets backed up and then immediately comes in close again on his opponent. Oh, another big right hand. That right hand of Ray Leon is not going to close the show right now, but the, it's going to pay dividends as this fight progresses. Little left Stop. lands there. I think that one may have been a little bit low, that kick. Right. Inside low kick from Ray Leon. Ray Leon, a long time fighter here. I think that's really the story here between these two is the experience, the age. And there's also a, a well, there's, there's a height advantage in favor of the Cypriot. However, that seems to be his only advantage here. And youth is on his side. Stop. End of We're round one. two coming up and let's go back and take a look at some highlights here i think that ray leon is going to take that first round he that right hand landed several times two three four times very hard to the side of the face of reb azishvili but there's Second still out. a long way to go Second still out, please. six minutes left in this contest let's see what happens here Second in round number out. two Well, the referee demanding that the second gets Judge. out of the ring in the corner Judge. of Revazishvili. Second they were round. taking their sweet time over there Judge. in the corner. Time. Fight. Here we go, round number two, and Ray Leon already again putting the pressure on, but Revazishvili backing him up with a couple of left jabs. Good combination shots now by the Moldovan. In fact, if you, if you remember correctly, longtime fans of Coliseum Tournament, Maxime Ray Leon fought against the referee, uh, Ionut Ato Derese, oh, oh, and, uh, and beat him. Actually hit him in the ribs with a kick and broke one of his ribs Stop. and ended the fight. And no, speaking no, of ending no, the fight with, uh, with an injury, I hope that is not the situation that we have right now. You can see that there is a cut over the right eye, it looks like. Of, uh, of Ray Leon, and it was pouring out blood, Gabriel. Yep. I hope that they can get that bleeding under control. It would be a shame to see uh, the semifinal end like this, but I'm sure it would be great news for Reva Zishvili. Team. Everybody said Levan is Fight. not a fighter for this pyramid. I think he's showing he's a fighter for this pyramid. Especially when round two opened up. He, yep. he, he seemed a lot more aggressive. Now he seems more comfortable in there. And let's see what he can do. Wow, that was a cracking shot there. But he didn't move it. I, I like a lot the Maxim Reyland. He's, he's one of my favorites. He's really putting the pressure yeah. on. Yeah. Good body kick there. A lot of power generated. Speaking of power, fires right back. Big left there. Oh, oh my! Oh. These two are really 
really trading oh. here. Look at this war which is developing. This fight. Rivers is feeling oh. he's back and down. Now he's giving it right back. Oh, and he comes in with a knee. Daniel, believe me, this fight is good for Maxim. This fight is good for the fans. Yes. Oh, and he's busted that eye open again. And there's blood pouring out. Oh, look at this offense now from the Cypriot. I think he won this round. I think he, he won this round until now. Look at the face of Rayleon. That is the face of a warrior. And he's coming oh. right after him now. Oh. Looking for revenge. Look at that knee, though. Boy, round number two is really starting to heat up here. Just out of range, but he did make contact there with that right hand looking for the body and nobody home. Clubbing shot. Back and forth they go. Oh, he loaded up with that one. Out of range and tagged him on the way out. And remember, folks, Stop. remember fight. that this fight, whoever wins it, will have to fight again later in the evening for the championship. What is going to be left of the winner? You can see blood now coming out of the nose of Revajishvili. Both men bleeding now. Closing seconds. And the Stop. end of an absolutely brutal round number two. <music> Ladies and gentlemen, there is blood all over the fighters. There's blood all over the ring. There's blood all over my commentary station, all over my notes, all over me, probably. This one is not for the weak at heart. If there are small children in the room, it is now time to put them to sleep. This one is only going to get more sadistic as time goes on. And remember that the winner still must fight again. Take a look at these highlights here from round number two. Second out. These two are just hammering Second each out. other for three solid minutes. Second out. So now we're, we're going to find out what these two are really made of here. Two rounds down, one left to go. Judge, 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 round three. Time, fight. Here we go. The Cypriot scores first. Rayleon still continues to press forward. Goes upstairs, got some of it. Pushing him back now. I think that uh, Gabriel Georgescu was correct in saying that Levan Revazishvili in the red gloves is the underdog in this tournament. There's no question about it. If he could beat Rayleon here and move to the finals, he would immediately raise the price of his stock, not only in Coliseum tournament, but internationally as well. Low kicks continue to go in from the Cypriot. Raylion still putting on the pressure here. Ooh, he clocked him that time. One minute gone by. Misses with the jumping knee. And again, our photographer almost got his clock cleaned. Oh, crushing body shot. And a right hand as well upstairs. Oh, my. Raylion starting to unload with the heavy artillery. You can see. Oh, good God. What a shot that was. Raylion just drilled him. Look at this. Maxim Raylion making a statement here in round three. Oh, and another one. Just jacked his jaw. This crowd is going ballistic.
missed it. Riley on, putting the pressure on. How much more can Revelishvili take? Blood kept pouring out of his nose now. This is a big round. This is a turning point in the fight here for Raylion. Oh, backing him up with jabs and unloads with the right. Oh, God, what another shot that was. Looking for the liver now. Raylion just going to town. Good low kick in response. Oh, but he ate a right. I think he's getting tired in there, and he's he's in a lot of pain, no doubt. And he, he's getting a little bit sloppy with his defense. Closing seconds. Oh, God, a knee went in that time. Stop. That's it. Go back in now. And for the second time in this tournament, we go to the judges. All three judges scored the same way in favor of your winner by unanimous decision. And now advancing to the tournament final later tonight, out of the blue corner, Maxime Rania! Da, da, Maxime Rania, din colțul albastru, Moldovanul, câștigătorul celor...